Hey guys, movie fan here to give you a small little reaction video. My friend Jonathan the Reviewer suggested I check out an episode of Bat Wheels. Now, I'm sure you all know what it is. It's basically a kid's cartoon where the Batmobile and pretty much every other vehicle he's got is, you know, it's, it's alive, it's artificial intelligence. They go and take down criminals and all that stuff. But obviously it's meant for little kids and I'm familiar with it, but I'm not too familiar with it because... Again, it's just for little kids, so it's not for me. However, this one was extra special because of, well, um... This is the awesomely dynamic Automobile, also known as Adam! Greetings, citizen. The crime fighter's crusade, not tempered by loyalty and faith, is hollow at best. I won't rest until we get to the bottom of this. Woohoo! Get that! That's it, exactly. Now, I watched this episode, and I gotta say, I am very impressed with it. It was a great shout out in so many ways, because obviously, you got the original Batmobile from 1966 featured into this. And what makes it even better is the fact that it's literally voiced by Adam West. Now, obviously, he's been gone a while. He rest in peace. But they used old recordings of him because, let's get real, he had such a signature voice that nobody could ever duplicate that if they tried. So they used some old recordings. It comes off really well. Because I can't picture this Batmobile being done by anyone else. And even better yet, his name is actually Adam. Obviously, we got another great shout out to Adam West himself for that one. And I'm glad they did that. And throughout the episode, it's mostly just uh, them trying to find the bad guys and take them down. And to save the current Batmobile's friends. Basically, it's all nostalgia from here. Because, you know, you see iconic things like... The bat symbol from 1966 is coming up a lot with his bat battering ram and his grappling hook and all that. To the bat cave! And of course, there's a scene where they go literally up the side of a building, just like in the series. And there's even a small moment where Adam uses his battering ram on one of the other vehicles. And, well, it does a quick bam. It doesn't say it, but you see the flash. It's a no-brainer. And there's only one thing I could say. If you're all about nostalgia and you love the original series of Batman, and especially if you're a fan of Adam West, you should check this out because it's definitely worth watching. I want to thank my friend Jonathan for telling me about this episode and for insisting on me reviewing it. It was definitely worth watching, Jonathan. Thanks a lot. This is Movie Fan, signing off.